in Detroit, out in the suburbs. You got some of the nicest houses I've ever seen. Yeah. You got some of the nicest There's neighborhoods. There's a lot there. of old money in Detroit when mm -hmm. you get out to, like, Farmington Hills and all them places. It's been bought old money in Detroit. There's no new money there. That's been a war zone for the last 15, 20 years. Yeah, certain parts There's is nice. New so. money. There's new money. There's, there's new money there. Nah. Somebody's got to be making money off of that. that I'm, I'm, talking, that dude, dude, oh, I'm yeah. talking about money with a capital M. Uh, Big money. Flip like it. We have here in Manhattan. It's called uh, Billionaire's Row on 57th Street. Know. It's nice, man. You just walk by. You can smell the money. My man, Richie. I'm sorry. Last time I was in New York, it smelled pee. I smelled pee. <laughs> I oh, you were in the wrong shit. neighborhood. <laughs> you, were wrong, right? you were in the wrong neighborhood. He was in Brooklyn. <laughs> I was there to go to the Anthony Cumia show. I got there off on a bus. Uh oh. And I, I collected all the money from all the jerks who watched my uh, my live stream. Uh oh. But uh, what would you? Know, you... New York is not a beautiful town. It's not some great city uh, like Paris. Well, or there's something. certain places are really nice. There's some sort that's located there, but there's a lot of money in New York. Yeah. Tremendous amount of money. That's how old the city. Fuck, is. What a smartphone! What are you jerking off in there? I'm thinking about the garbage. That's what exactly what I said. Oh. <laughs> New York. Oh, yeah. Where do you live? Can that be revealed, or are you on? Are you kidding me? We don't even know his name. I've been calling him Fredo all night. Yeah, right. I'm in a. I'm in. I'm in the South. Are you in an okay. undisclosed location? He's probably in Ohio. He's you probably can, in Ohio. You can probably name. You can probably name the state. No Cincinnati. Yeah, you can name the state. Mississippi, Tennessee. I'm in, I'm in one of the 11 states. I'm, I'm in one of the 11 states. Dude, that, uh, what the that fuck? Are you serious? Come on. What state are you in? Yeah, uh, no. Huh? It's a bad, 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 bad. Why aren't you just smart enough to lie? Uh, this is not a legend. I, 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 I have lived in. I'll tell you what cities I've lived in. You want to tell you that? I want to know that. We, yeah, we, let's wanna, play multiple choice. We, we want to know the state you're in. Forget it. We don't want to fucking know. I don't, I'm not, I don't care about anything, really. <laughs> Yeah, you know what it sounds like. I mean, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not doing. I'm not saying I got a court. I have my own life, right? Sure. You know, I have a life. Well, you gotta have your own life. Well, I hope so. Right? Someone else's life. I, but I'm curious. I, I'm curious, Richie. Do you still live in New York, or did you move away? Yeah, yeah smartphone doesn't want to tell us his first name, but he wants to know exactly which borough in New York, maybe which street. <laughs> no, I don't want to know. No, I just want to know. Hey, I Richie, know uh, what's your social security number, Richie? Hey, smartphone. But listen, I gotta ask you a serious question. Now we're all on the fucking thing, and you feel a little loose right now. What, what what's what, what's the big deal with with your other show? What do you really feel? Do you enjoy about? Is it is it the busting on Jammy all the whole time, or really like what is your yeah, interest on that much, other show? That's, it. that's pretty much it. I like busting on Jammy. It doesn't get old though. I, I call no. I call in the shows. I called in Andy Dick and imp personing uh, you know Jammy, and it was one of the best parts of his little show. Really. You know, I yeah, no, I like doing <laughs> yeah. that. I like having fun and busting balls, but it gets old, you know, a little bit after a while, doesn't it? And then when you're watching another show about talking about how another show sucks, that gets old, doesn't it? Or not really? Well, I, I, no, the character of Jim Renam is 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 beautiful. That's a, a beautiful to me. The mm -hmm. guy oh, with a deep voice and the radio voice. And he well, he's, my a, ass and he's a hack, <laughs> though. He's a hack, bro. He's a phony. No, but the character, the character is a good character. I mean, I, the, his real life is horrible. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's crazy. He's got uh, colonic dependency issues. Yeah. he's got problems. But the the character he, that that he he, he he has a deep voice. He comes on the radio and he he worships Howard, Howard Stern. Stern. And, he's not. And he's he, has, he has a, But I'm not talking about Jim Ernan as a whole. I'm talking about watching uh, being on a show that just reviews Jim Ernan the whole show. Doesn't that yeah. get fucking old? Like, we're just riffing it up. We're all just talking. We're having fun. It kind of goes anywhere it wants to go. But if I had an agenda and go, okay, guys, now we're going to go back to Jimmer. Wouldn't that? I, I think I think Matt, he could he could do some other stuff. I think that he got personal when that guy called his house. Yeah, I know. I think that, yeah, I understand that. I, I didn't like that either. I think, that, I think Matt will come around and start doing the show that he was doing before. And I think he, I think he's good at what he does. He's mm -hmm. better than Jimmer Nam. He's better oh, than yeah. Kyle. Mm -hmm. He's he's got an idea of what he wants to do, right? That the one thing about Matt is, I don't think his interests line up with that of too many other people. Like, like you what have you to mean? be interested in something in like common. Fortnite. No. Yeah. No. Like, he talks about this radio station that nobody even heard of when it was around. And Kanye and West. W like, yeah, who gives a fuck about this? Gym People, shoes. These are all the things you, we make fun of Sam. But Robert it's all the for. shit that you would think smartphone wouldn't like, isn't it? What? I, well, yeah, smartphones interesting. Look, I have I have voiced my opinion on some of the stuff. I've not not voiced my opinion on 
on some of that stuff. Well, I know you like ragging on people and having fun, so I could see you doing a segment over there. But spending the whole show, I don't know. I, I, just I hardly ever fun. contribute. I, I, uh, the only thing I contribute was the drops, uh, <laughs> the sound drops, and you got your little. But they were funny. Yeah, come on, they are the, funny. The sound drops They're are funny. funny. I, but don't you feel I like don't you really fit? Contribute. Don't you feel like you fit in a little bit better over here? <laughs> I, you're, you're a sly one there, Donnie. Well, you're, I'm you're, just asking a you're question. A sly, you're really trying to get me to. You're trying to get me to reveal stuff. <laughs> you're trying to get no, me. I, no problem. Fredo, don't even tell us his name, uh, Richie. Well, uh, what what I'm I, 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 in real estate. <laughs> I have some real estate rental properties, and uh, it's good enough for me. Well, hey, pretty much, I'm not good. retired. I want to say I'm retired, but you know, pretty much. You are the shitster that's what you do you you know a lot about all these shows that other people don't know because you watch them all right and you're able to zero in on weak spots and you know i just think that's clickbait clickbait is the shit story he's the one who makes makes a video on it clickbait's funny well yeah he he, he, it doesn't i don't have to watch jimmer nam for anything more than the pure comedy of cringe yeah i I, to (laughs) It well, Jimmer, the only thing Jimmer's got is that chat, man. Other than that, you know, his show is fucking horrible. But no, he doesn't got... have the chat anymore. Well, he, he, when he did. A there's a schism. The, the cam whore took half the chat or more, and he's stuck with some other leftovers. It's kind of It's hilarious. garbage. Now, I haven't been on that show in a long time, but. <laughs> she cucked him. She cucked him. The, the cam whore left, and she had made his Discord. And people are still in the Discord over there, and not everybody's come over to the new Discord. Right, but I told Kyle as soon as those. The first time when Jimmer Nam quote unquote me tooed me, it was because I was on Kyle's show saying Jimmer Nam's not a pimp. He can't control these broads. What's he doing bringing <laughs> broads on this show? They're gonna end up fucking ruining it for him. They're gonna take it off. These are these are street hookers online. I said his pimp hand is way too weak. That's funny. These bitches are gonna. Ru- and what did they do? Three four weeks later, what did they do? They ruined his fucking show. But yeah, how fucking lame that. is it, though? How can you but respect you a guy wait, 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 who completely wait. takes a whole fucking... I mean, he took Howard Stern's whole logo and everything else. I mean, if that's not the that's biggest the fucking hack, you don't think that's hacky? No, I think it's just like being a wigger. You wear the clothes, you say the words, you do everything, but everybody can tell you're not black, you dumbass. <laughs> he makes his voice sound like Stern a little bit. He does a he little bit. Yeah, like that. That whole uh, fucking yeah. That whole uh, I just woke up in the morning bullshit, right? Uh, yeah, that's you it. You know, Galista, uh, you're Galista, Galista, you're a two faced mother upper. That's what you are, Galista. <laughs> I, I told the truth. It kind of sounded I like him. Right I told the truth right <laughs> <on>. <laughs> <laughs> and then he, But his voice cracks. He goes, oh, "No, oh, he was he was making fun of uh, Jimmer, Mark." No, I, yeah, I, I was. I, I can tell you this, Don. Yeah. Jimmer now, I can tell by watching him when he talks, he spent a lot of time in the mirror right. working on Stern's cadence and rhythm. It's weird, man. It's mm-hmm. fucking weird. I've never seen anything like it. I've seen some real posers, man. But that fucking guy, he's got to take the cake. Serious. And well, I feel bad. I, hate, I like to take it back to a Scorsese movie called King of Comedy. Hey, there you go. That's Bobby, hilarious. Where Bobby, and we have, uh, we have you know, everybody's favorite Jewish comedian, you know. He plays uh, what, oh, Carson Carson in the movie. Jerry Lewis. Yeah, he plays Carson. That's <laughs> Jerry right. Lewis is in that movie. <laughs> Lewis, and he actually did a good fucking job, though, in that movie. You got to admit, Richie, I know you don't like the guy. You know why, you know why he did a good job in that movie? Because that was him. Because he was playing an asshole. Playing an asshole. Right. Movie. Yep, I got no, it. He, he did a good fucking movie. job. That's fucking him. Go ahead, hey, Mark. Before we leave no, the that- subject, I just, before we leave the subject, I just want to say, yeah. I, I'm, not, I'm not hating on the guy. I think that in the same way, if you're an Elvis fan, you sort of could listen to an Elvis impersonator mm-hmm. and see what's different. Like, I mean, Jim and Nam's just doing something that a million people have tried in a different medium forever, whether it's music or comedy or anything else. There's always yeah. people try to steal somebody's act. This is the first mm-hmm. time where there's a medium that's open where you can probably rip off somebody's act and make something out of it. I think what he's doing is interesting. Hmm. I just think it'll probably be somebody else that pulls it off, you know. I got you. Yeah, somebody that's not Chinese. Well, that, that's for you to say, Don. I don't know. That, that, that's more your reality. Maybe no, I don't know. I'm just uh, wondering. I'm, like, what would make him be uh, successful at ripping off Howard Stern than somebody I, else? I'm North Korean and my mom's Chinese. Get it straight uh, there, Don. I, I would say this would be a better... 